What's going on guys? Alex here, Nickens Lawn and Landscape. I want to talk about a series that I'm going to be doing on some organization stuff. Uh, but first, got a little motivation. It's Monday morning. I just left a project. We're looking at uh, retaining well. We're going to be starting on Wednesday. Talked about that a little bit on Instagram. If you guys follow us on there, you've seen it. If you don't follow us on there, check us out. But I got a little motivation on the way here. I was listening to some Gary V. And uh, he just... Everything he's got is good. Every time he talks, you can it, it's easy to listen to and it's easy to kind of take in, but he's he just gives you a lot of motivation. He was talking about being in it for the long haul and why when you know you're good kind of or when you know that you have talent and you're in it for the long haul, you're going to win as long as you're not arrogant, you know, you're you're bound to win one way or another. It may take time. It's going to take time, but good things are definitely going to happen if, if that's the path you follow unless you have a terminal illness or something out of your control but if you have if you have control I mean as long as you're in control and you know like I said you got talent or you got a skill and you stick with it you're going to be as a whole on social media the biggest question that I get is how do you grow your business and it takes time you can't rush it you have to just be patient that's the biggest thing you have to have patience if you don't have patience you're in for a lot of a lot of struggling and a lot of being frustrated you have to be patient you have to know like i just said that it's going to come and you, you just have to you have to have the mindset to be able to look down the road and, and not look at next week or next month or even next year but you have to say you know at all times where do you want to be in five years okay in five years me personally I don't know if I'll be mowing grass I'd like to be doing landscape hardscape installs and you know minor excavating I don't want to do anything crazy but I want to you know do grading and backfilling and, and some light clearing and things like that but that's that's my goal for five years and I know where I want to be I may have a long career or two but me personally I don't want to be mowing grass so that's my goal I don't know your goal may be totally different. Your goal in five years may to have may to be to have 400 lawns. I mean that that may be your goal, or you may be want to be out of lawn care. You may not even do lawn care right now. You may work at McDonald's, and in five years you want to own a McDonald's. I don't know what you do. It doesn't matter what you do as long as you have a projected goal and you know where you want to be. And you somewhat have to know what it takes to get there, but you also have to know that if you knew exactly what it took to get there, you'd already be there. So you don't know, and that's why you're not there. So you, you have to have a goal. You have to be somewhat educated on the work or the style or whatever it is it's going to take to get there. But if you have those things and you're patient, you'll be fine. You just have to realize that it's not going to happen overnight. It's, it's going to take time, and you'll get there if you really want to get there. That's my motivation for the morning. Like I said, I, I felt some motivation and, and I want to pass it forward to you guys. So that's my motivation for Monday morning. But about this organizational series, whatever you want to call it, I don't even know what I want to call it yet. But I'm going to, I have a lot of little organization things that I do. I'm kind of OCD on some stuff. I mean, I'm not, I'm not crazy, but I do have some little tips and tricks that help me out. share those with you guys it's not anything too crazy they're gonna be two three minute videos but I'm thinking to do one a week and I'm thinking I'm gonna shoot to do 25 of them it's gonna be everything from the shop to the mowers to the trucks to my office and the way I keep things in there my personal whatever just the way that I organize and the way that I keep things going to me it makes a big difference when you're organized if you're not organized it just makes everything harder everything is so much harder to get completed jobs are much harder and you guys know any job that you do in our industry you have to have tools so if you don't have the tools or you can't find the tools it's hard to get the job done so you need your tools you need to be organized you need to know where things are and a lot of times for us landscapers and lawn care guys in the spring rush or even in the summer whenever anytime during the season really here in the Midwest you're going crazy I mean you you're just running yourself ragged and you don't really have time 
to be looking for tools and doing all that stuff. So I think, me personally, I think this series is gonna help a lot of people. I don't know if it will. I don't know if it's gonna take like I think it might, but I think for the people who do watch it and do follow it and struggle with organization and pick up on these tips, I think it's really gonna help you guys out. So be sure to be looking out for those. I'm gonna release them on Saturday mornings and I'm gonna plan on starting this coming Saturday, which is March, third i want to say that could be wrong but I, I think it's march 3rd but anyway the first saturday in march is when this first one's going to come out and it's going to be every saturday plan is for 25 saturdays uh hopefully i can do that i think i can so that's going to be the plan but like i said i really think this is going to help you guys out i hope you enjoyed this monday motivation you guys all have a great day i'll see you in the next one.